Hi, Mom. Yeah, closing tonight. What's up? Well, I just wanted to know, is it true that the reason that uh, Luke went to your work last night to see you was really not to see you? He wanted to see this hot babe that works with you. Is that true? Uh, let's ask Luke. It's not true. <laughs> Where'd you get that idea, Dad? Oh, you just put two and two together and it makes four. <laughs> one and one makes two. Oh, okay. Oh, Dad, you cracked me up. What's up, Mom and, Mom and Luke? Sorry to interrupt the conversation. Just, you know, we're rolling and You're, we just, how many hours we're rolling and we don't have time working? to stop and edit this, you know? How many hours a week are you working? It seems like you're always going to work. No, I'm only working 16 hours this week. It's totally, right. yeah. I need, I'm actually, I need to get my availability yet, which is why I'm going to go to work a little bit earlier today. So I can get some more hours, because I dropped a class. Hey! Rocky, what do you think you know you're doing? He's saying. He's saying it's time to run <laughs> yeah, he is. Poor doggies. Thank you, Luke, for running them yesterday. I had to go... I went and played frisbee yesterday um, at my school, and so I didn't have time to run the dogs, and so Luke ran them yesterday. You're welcome. If I can just take a minute. Hey, shut up! <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Say thank you to everyone who supported me on my New Orleans mission, missions trip. Really appreciate it, guys. You made it possible. Oh, uh, Luke, Luke is sending out his thank you letters, so that's what he's talking it's about. me in the group there. He went to um, New Orleans um, over Christmas break. Oh, that's... That's you and Shelby. Shelby. That's right. I know your name. Cool. That's you again. Carrying along. Sweet, man. And if you guys are wondering what's up... Oh, where'd it go? Oh, yeah. What's up with this dog? Janet brought her dog home. Um, she was living in Fullerton, and then she brought her dog home. So now we have three dogs in the backyard. And I used to take that little dog up on the hill with me when I would go on a hike. But it started not listening to me, and it wouldn't come when I called it. So I was like, all right, dog, sorry, dude, but I can't take you. So now it just yaps every time I take the big dogs, but that's what he gets. Sorry, doggy. Hi, Rocky. Hey, don't leave the gate open this time, okay? Phil, don't leave the gate open. Let the little dog out. Uh, yeah, 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 you got it, Dad. Too. There's lots of dogs around there, Phil. Dad's... passive aggression there, maybe? No. I said it was an accident, and I really didn't mean it. I left the gate open last time I ran the big dogs up the hill, and so the little dog, Janet's dog, got out and came up the hill with me, and then Janet was like all freaking out because her dog was out, and yeah, it, it wasn't a pleasant time, but, so Dad's telling me to close the gate next time, so. Yes, Dad, you got it. I'll try my best. I wasn't accusing you of anything honest. You know, passive aggression, people that are passive aggressive don't always even realize it. You know, they can't help themselves. So you're saying I'm just... passively aggressive? Well, because they left the gate open. Jan, yeah, Jan, they, Jan was like hounding me yesterday because she's like, "Why'd you leave the gate open? Why'd you?" I was just like, "Jan, I'm sorry. Like it was an accident." And then like the whole day she was just at me for that. But anyways, all right. Not sure what to film now because whoa, what's going on here? Uh. Hey, right, you shut up now. <laughs> you shut up now. <laughs> we should probably spake her because we usually don't let her. Yeah, you get her. Shut <laughs> up now! Huh? Huh? <laughs> um, we keep these things here, and when uh, Rocky starts barking, we usually... Watch, she won't even come in right now. Come on in, Rocky, come on, come on. Oh, she did! Alright, I'm gonna hang up with you guys. Hang up, as if we're like on a telephone call. I'm gonna, oh, she's trying to go outside now because she sees this. Okay, I'm gonna hang up with you guys and take care of my dog real quick. Bye! Chilling at home now, after work with Luke. And we're looking at uh, stocks and stuff. Um, Luke's kind of sort of getting into stocks right now. And I was just sitting here showing him my um, Scott Trade account. I was showing him my Bank of America stock. I have Citigroup stock. And El Dorado Gold. It's a Canadian gold company stock. And I had BP stock. And I should have held on to it. I made like 160 bucks in just a few weeks. And I should have held on to it. Because now it's up to 47 bucks. I bought it at 34. And I sold it at 46. Three, and now it's at 47 and had 18 shares. So. Which I kept you gotta it, buy low and sell high. Yeah, we're dude. About here. And what stocks are you looking at? The bear stocks. Bear stocks? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I don't know. You just gotta. I always try to pick the stocks I think are gonna go up. Obviously. <laughs> that's kind of self explanatory. Anyways, so that's yeah. what we're doing. Yeah. yeah. The Dow Jones is also a good pick. <laughs> We're looking at um, Apple stock, and that thing was like, uh, this is like total, like, financial um, talk right now. Sorry, it's late. Um, but yeah, we're looking at um, Apple stock, and it was like, my 
my chair is really squeaky. Um, it was like 70 bucks back at the crash, like when the, all the market went down. And then I was talking to Luke, and now it's at what? It's over $300. Three, it's like three twenty, three thirty dollars and we're like, dang, we should have bought some Apple stock back in the day because it's pretty high now. And then we're like, oh, should we buy some more? And then we see this and it says, Apple without jobs. This is a business week. Love to read it. And um, so now we're like, oh, now we don't know, you know? So I don't know. We're just, just kind of feeling the market out, deciding on what we want. <laughs> Look away, boy, sneezes. I mean, blows his nose. Anyways, anything you want to say, Luke? Before I say goodnight? No. <laughs> Are you sure? Mm -hmm. You look like you're just about to explode with an idea as soon as I turn the camera off. <laughs> Alright, see you guys later. Bye. Hey guys! What? No, just cut it right there. <laughs>